there were gangsters before us. And Allah the Almighty, He gripped them and Allah the Almighty destroyed them. The likes of Karun, this guy was a gangster and Allah the Almighty gripped him. Allah the Almighty gripped him. The earth opens and takes him in. This is what happens to a gangster. The likes of Fir'aun, this guy was another gangster. Yet again, Allah the Almighty disliked him. Allah the Almighty hated him so much that Allah gripped him. The oceans open and they crush him. And he's in Turkey Museum today. So mankind will reflect. Why? Because Allah says that we will leave his body right till the day of judgment. So mankind will reflect. The lives of the people of Ard. Yet again, these guys were proper gangsters. And Allah the Almighty disliked these people. And Allah the Almighty gripped them. The tornadoes came and destroyed them. Now this guy, Nimrud, this guy was a proper gangster. I'm not talking about them wannabe gangsters from Alam Rock, or from Small Heath, or from Spark Hill, or from Hansworth or Low Zalf, or from Aston or Smethwick. This guy, Nimrud, this guy was a gangster and Allah the Almighty hated his gangsterness. The Allah the Almighty, he sends a mosquito to go through his ear, to land on his brain and eat off his brain until this guy drops to his knees. A death of a dog. You want to live by the gun? Then indeed you're going to die by the gun. You want to know about real men? Then look at mans like Harun Rashid and Mu'attasim. Harun Rashid, the Amir al Mu'minin of his time. A Kafir leader of Rome. He writes a letter and says to Harun Rashid that I will not pay jizya. Harun Rashid. He replies to his letter and says, In the name of Allah, the most merciful, the most compassionate. From Amirul Mu'mineen, Harun Rashid, to the dog of Rome, I have received your letter, you son of a kafirah. Remember one thing, you will not hear my reply. You will see my reply. The army is dispatched and this kafir is brought to the feet of Harun Rashid. This is why he called real men. The likes of Mu'attasim. A Muslim woman is captured. She's in prison. And a kafir slaps her. And then she shouts out and she says, Oh Mu'attasim, where are you? Oh Mu'addasim, where are you? When she says this, this kafir laughs at her and says, Yes, indeed, your man Mu'addasim is coming. He's coming on a black and white horse to save you. The news reaches Mu'addasim. Mu'addasim purchases 17,000 black and white horses. 17,000. The commander is Mu'attasim. The army is dispatched. They go towards this land. The Kuffar's army is defeated and is crushed. Mu'attasim is there. This Kafir is brought to Mu'attasim. This Muslim woman is brought to Mu'attasim. And Mu'attasim says to this woman that tell this kafir 
the Muaddasim has come on a black and white horse to save you. This is why you call real men.